All right, adventurers, welcome back to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. If you guys missed last episode, first off, you probably want to go check that out because it'll it'll explain why we're still doing the Nuzlocke. Um, we're here in Vermilion City. We're in Kanto. Let's see. Uh, let's see what all there is to see within the beautiful city of Kanto. First off, we need to heal. Nobody's superly badly damaged. Superly. Nobody's superly badly damaged, but we do need to heal up. So let's head to the Pokemon Center. All right. Kanto, Kanto's going to be wild. Let me tell you guys this much. Like I said, I've only played this game. I've only played Gen 2 and then the Gen 4 remakes. A total of three times, counting this playthrough. I have not once done the Kanto side of this game, so I really have no idea. Uh, let's see. Of this game, I've never uh, done the Kanto side. I've done Gen 2's Kanto side once. That's it. Uh, I, I really have no idea what we're about to face here right now, okay? So, so more or less, this is a blind part of the playthrough. I, I know I know the city. Uh, come on, guys. You guys know I know Kanto pretty well. But I, I, don't, I don't know what's different between Gen 2 and this one because there was so much time passed between. Pokemon Fan Club. All Pokemon fans are welcome. Well, I consider myself a fan, so let's go ahead inside. Look at the fan club. Look at that. Look at it. She's got a, a Bayleaf. Bayleaf's pretty cool. Bayleaf's a cool Pokemon. Look at my darling Bayleaf. The leaf on its head is so cute and fashionable. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Honestly, if I had a Bayleaf, I would walk around with a Bayleaf too. Perry's cool at all, but I walk around with a Bayleaf. It's something about the, the quadruped Pokemon that makes walking around with them cool. Our chairman is very lo vocal. He's local. He's very vocal when it comes to our Pokemon. Is this him? I'm the chairman of this Pokemon fan club. I've raised over 150 Pokemon. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. Did you visit just to hear about my Pokemon? Sure. Good. Then listen up. This is so my precious Rabidash. It's cute. Lovely, smart, adorable, irresistible, plus amazing. Don't you think so? Oh, so wild, beautiful, kind. I love it. Hug it. It's warm and cuddly. Oh, it's spectacular, captivating, simply divine. I treasure it. Oops, look at the time. I've kept you too long. I've also kept you too long. Thanks for hearing me out. I want to give you this present. Hey, he gave us a rare candy. That's what's up. That's what's up. It's a rare candy that oh, it's a rare candy that makes Pokemon stronger. I prefer making my Pokemon stronger by battling, so you can have it. All right, all right, fine. Thanks for the rare candy, family. Hey, oh, wrong. It's not his voice. I love the way Clefairy opens up its arms. It's so adorable. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What's in this building? This is a house. Let's talk to. It. Wow, he is walking right into mom. Saffron, Saffron, I want to go to Saffron City to see the Magnet Train. Magnet Train. He's being an annoying little kid, isn't he? Do you know about the Magnet Train? It's a railway that connects Kanto and Johto. Uh, I mentioned that last episode. One of the ways we can get between Kanto and Johto now is a Magnet Train. So let's see. We have the pathway. I'm sorry, we can surf between New Bark Town and the Pokemon League. We can... uh. Take the magnet train, and now we can go by boat. As we got a few, a few hundred ways to get between uh, Kanto and Johto, we can pick our poison. Over many years, Diglett dug a large tunnel. That tunnel goes to a distant town. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That's actually just what is that? East, Easter Town, I believe. Let's see. Let's take a look. Let's take a great gander. Up here, and then this way. Yeah, there's the cave. That there's a Snorlax in front of the cave. I was actually, I don't know why I was not expecting it, to be honest. But I wasn't expecting there to be a Snorlax there. All right. So it looks like to go through that cave, we'll have to wake the Snorlax one way or another. Feet, we're going to hit it with an awakening. That's not you. That's not how you wake it up. This man. I am the fishing dude, the elder of the fishing bros. Have you met the fishing guru at Lake of Rage? No. We didn't. Were we supposed to? We went to Olivine, right? 
Didn't we go to Olivan City and get a fishing rod? I think that's where we did. Didn't we? So we didn't meet that one. He dreams about seeing the world's greatest magic carp. If you don't mind, could you show him any magic carp you catch? Who knows? Maybe you'll catch the magic carp of his dreams. All right, so I guess that's where we get the other fishing rod. I don't know why I didn't think of Lake of Rage. That's like an important place. <laughs> it's an important place. This guy should have been there. My Pokemon just preparing the line for construction. We've had this conversation before, haven't we? He's been doing this for three years now. But I have no money to start the project. Uh, well, I'm sorry. You got to get you some investors, buddy. Hello, just what you least expected. I am Cameron the photographer. You look so photogenic. Why not have a picture taken? Okay, I believe we've already done one pic one of these pictures here. We can take a picture. All right, there. Get yourselves ready. All right, so we're going to pose with Team Snaps and Claps. Hey, look at that. Look at the team. We got Victoria hiding in the background. You can see all the pictures on your PC. All right. Appreciate it, camera. Thank you. Thank you kindly. And then there's the shot. Then there's the shot. Hey. All right. What else we got? What, what you got in the store? You got anything special? Is there anything special? No, I'll buy it. Nope. Nothing special from you. Let's talk to this man up here. Come on. What we got? What we got? What we got? A nest ball, dust ball, and quick ball. Dust balls. You know, typically, I would be using dust balls because they work like ultra balls if it's nighttime. And I believe they're cheaper. I believe they're a little bit cheaper. But I don't think I've played this game once at night yet. It's weird. Quick balls, though. We can get some quick balls. Quick balls would be helpful. Quick balls work best if you use it on the very first turn of battle. That's the one that I've been getting mixed up with the fast balls every single time. So we're going to buy 10 quick balls. I don't really need to buy more than that because you can really only use it on the first turn. So I'll know if I'm running out or not. Uh, nest balls work on weak Pokemon. I don't think we're going to run into anything specifically weak. I'm not answering the phones. I'm not taking any phone calls right now. I'm not taking any phone calls. We're, we're on vacation. We're here in Vermilion City. All right, ladies and gentlemen. There's a, there's, a, there's a gym. There's a gym here in Vermilion City. And what we used actually, I think we still can. Uh, what we needed to do before is we had to cut down this tree to get to the gym. But since we have Pokemon that have Surf, what we can do is we can Surf in the water. Come on, Perry. You got to be faster, dog. We got stuff to do. We can surf in the water and go around to the side that is unblocked. And we can do the gym there. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Are we going to do the gym today? I think I think I actually need to train the team up a little bit. Because remember, our, our leader here, Perry, is a water type. Oh, wait. That's right. It's randomized. I'm a dumb. We should be fine in this gym. Let's let's see how we fare in this. Oh God, they still have the puzzle. Oh my God, they still have the electric puzzle, and it doesn't look any better than back in the day. Okay, we're not doing this today, that's for sure. What I want to do though, I want to see. Let's see, can we fly? Cause I actually, let's get our encounter. Let's go ahead and get our encounter out the way. Let's do a little bit of fishing here in Vermilion City. Hey, all right, what's on the hook? Hey. Wild Pokemon music in, in Kanto. All right, we need another fishing rod. We need another fishing rod. Caterpie. Okay, Dupes Claws. We already have a Caterpie. That's noted by the Pokeball that's under Caterpie's name. So what we're going to do, we're going to use Dupes Claws. We're not catching a Caterpie. We're not catching another Caterpie. I refuse. I refuse. Come on. All right, what's on the hook this time? Well, I was saying the Kanto Wild Pokemon music, way better. Way better than the uh, the Johto music, in my opinion. I like it way better. Here's Unknown. This is a G Unknown. We already have Unknown, so we're going to throw it back. What do we have? We have the A Unknown. G would be cool, but we, we already have, we already have uh, an Unknown. We're going to give it one more shot. All right, what we got, what we got, what we got. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this today, ladies and gentlemen. You can't make me. You can't make me. You can't make me. Let's, let's go again. One more, one more. We're going to do a lot of fishing outside the gym here. Come on. 
Come on. All right, I'm just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna cruise on past this one. We're not, we're not catching anything right yet. We're not catching anything in Vermilion City. When we get another, uh, we get another. Actually, let's see if surfing will help us find anything. Let's see if we can find anything by surfing. Well, I was gonna say if we can find another rod. When we get another rod, then we'll, then we'll, we'll catch something. But let's see. Oh, 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 oh. All right. Drowsy. Drowsy. Not bad. We're seeing how Drowsy behaves on the team, ladies and gentlemen. Drowsy isn't bad. Four weren't allowed it, alerted it to surf. I have no idea why it would do that. Uh, quick ball. Let's try the quick ball here. Come on. It works best on the very first turn. All right. And then the ball kind of matches Drowsy. It's not bad at all. We got a Drowsy. Come on. Come on. Drowsy, the hypnosis Pokemon, it remembers every dream it eats. It rarely eats the dreams of adults because children's are much tastier. All right, so we once upon a time had a hypno on the team by the name of Gnome. Let's go ahead and name this Drowsy. Let's name this Drowsy Gnosis. This is Gnosis. Gnosis the Drowsy. All right, we can get out in the waters. Oh, God, we're going to do this. All right, let's see if I can get this item down here. I want this item. It's a miracle seed. Yo, we have the worst luck when it comes to items. Our, our item selection has been hashtag trash bag since the very beginning. Since the very beginning. Like, we've gotten the occasional rare candy, but we haven't found anything really good, you know? We've got, we've got so many hold items that boost attack types. I don't think we really have anything to worry about for the rest of forever. <laughs> we'll have anything to worry about for a good while. All right. Um... So let's see. There, there. Oh, oh, we could have an encounter here. We could have smashed these rocks. Nobody knows rock smash, do they? I don't think I even have. Did I pick up rock smash? Let's see. Rock smash. Rock smash is a HM, isn't it? I don't think it is. It's six. Okay, rock smash is six. We haven't picked up rock smash, which is weird. Which means I probably have to take a a, a flash trip back to. Back to Johto to get Rock Smash. I'll, I'll figure. I'll figure out what I'm doing with my life eventually, guys. Let's see if we can head over here and wake up this lovely Snorlax. We know it's sleeping. We know it's sleeping. There's a large Pokemon sleeping peacefully. It looks so content. All right, let's wake it up. Let's see. Do we have any item that can wake it up? Traditionally, it's a Poke Flute. It's a Poke Flute that'll wake up a sleeping Snorlax, but. We don't have a we don't have a poker flute, so we got to figure out how we're gonna get that. All right, and it looks like we can't really do anything else within the lovely city of Vermilion. So what we'll do is we'll head north. You guys remember, there's plenty of cities north of Vermilion City. Let's look at the map. When you're in trouble, you need to look at the map. So there are two cities north of here: one directly north, and then one connected to that city. We'll head up north. And we'll see what we can see around that way. Route six. All right, another route, another opportunity for an encounter. Let's see what we can find here. Withdraw. Withdraw is a, a perfect move for Pokemon. I'm not using withdraw. You can't. I'm not using withdraw, and you can't make me. You can't make me. Uh, let's see. Let's move Scav up front. It's because if we have an encounter, I, I don't want to waste a turn switching in if the quick ball fails. Here we go. Hey, it's a trap pitch. That's what's up. All right. Trap pitch on the team. Trap pitch will be a lovely addition to the team. I don't think we've used... I don't think we've used anybody from the trap pitch family. I could be entirely wrong. I could be horribly wrong. Here is one. And two. And three. We got a trap pitch. We got a trap pitch. That's what's up. 
All right, Trap Pinch and the Pokedex. Let's go ahead and read it. It's the Ant Pit Pokemon. Its nest is a sloped, bowl-like pit in the desert. Once something has fallen in, there's no escape. All right. Trap Inch. Trap Inch. Let's go ahead and name Trap Inch. Pride. Pride the Trap Inch. I'll probably take uh, Trap Inch out and heal it up. Because Trap Inch is one of the things that I've been complaining about the entire playthrough. He is diversity. He's ground type, and then when he evolves, he becomes a dragon type as well. He also has diversity. Like I said, Altaria is good in Gen 3, but after that, Altaria is not really too good. It's, it's not super special. The road is closed until the problem at the power plant is solved. So they got a power plant problem. There's a power plant problem. Maybe we can help solve it. Let's talk to this man. Welcome to Saffron City, home of the Magnet Train. That's what I say normally. That's what I normally say, but the Magnet Trains are running now. It's not getting any electricity because there's something wrong with the power plant. All right, so clearly the power plant is a huge thing. Hey, Saffron City. Saffron City's music. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Listen to it. Listen. Let's, let's see if we can go in this house. Don't call me Uncle Psychic. It's Mr. Psychic's house. That's weird. That's weird. Let's talk to this man. I got it. You wanted this. TM29. TM29 better be good. It's psychic. It's not really psychic. It may lower the target special defense. It won't lower special defense. Let's see what is TM29. How upset, how upset am I going to be? How upset do you guys think I'm going to be on a scale of 1 to 10? 10 being the highest possible. 10 being very pissed. And one being, you know, Till's going to be happy. TM29. Volt Tackle! Oh! Who chose one? Who said one? Whoever said one, they're perfect. Whoever said one, they, they called it. That's a dope move. Watch and nobody be able to. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and look at it. Let's go ahead and look. First, let's get Scav off the front. Let's get Scav off the front. Oh, Perry, uh, Perry, you go up front. I don't know why. I don't know what the hell Queen thinks she's doing, but Perry goes up front. All right, let's see who all can learn. Who can learn Volt Tackle normally? It's just Pikachu and uh, Pichu. I think in this game at least, uh, and then Raichu as well. Let's see who can learn Volt Tackle today. Who can learn Volt Tackle today? Queen. So I was just talking trash about Queen, and now she can learn Volt Tackle. Lovely, lovely. All right, let's see if we can head to the power plant. Uh, for those of you who don't know, the power plant should be around this area. Yep. Like I said, I know my Kanto. I know my Kanto. The power plant should be here, so we need to head north and then go west from there. Uh, east. Why do I keep doing that? Why do I keep doing that? All right. And then there's a gym here in Saffron City as well. It looks like there's two gyms. I don't know. Uh, let's see. How do we leave? There we go. Okay. So we get north from Saffron here. We are talking to this man. You are from Johto, aren't you? How do you like Kanto? I love it. Love it. It's great. Oh, beautiful air. Your trees look nice. It's nice, don't you? See, I just said it was nice. How many cities have you visited? Have you been to Cerulean City already? The view at Cerulean Cape is really something, isn't it? It's a good place for dates. Do you have anyone? Shut up. Shut up. You talk too much. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. All right. So this is... Route 5, there's an encounter here. We'll come back to that. Here's Cerulean City. We're just flying through the locations today, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so we need to head east from Cerulean City, which would be this way. And we need to get to the power plant so we get to the power plant and save the day. Because clearly, clearly, when so many people bring up the power plant, it's very clearly an issue. Very clearly. Soft sand. You guys remember what Miracle Seed and Charcoal and, and the Twisted Spoon do? Well, the Soft Sand does the same thing for ground-type attacks. Soft Sand makes it so that when a Pokemon holds it, its ground-type attacks deal more, more damage. Dang it. I was trying to sneak past this battle. I was trying to sneak past this battle. I came to explore Rock Tunnel. So what? So what? Now, the trainer battle theme here at Kanto? Dope. Honestly, I like it more than Johto. As much as I've been dancing to it in Johto, I like the, the Kando version better. 
Here's Haunch Crow. It's dark and flying. Dark and flying. We actually don't have. We don't have anybody good to deal with that. That's weird. We're searching the smells. Smells, we're in a foreign land. I need you to stop farting. Nasty plot. Was that special attack? Special attack went up. Dope. Not really. Here's a toxic. Oh, this toxic for me. Yeah, yo. Nasty plot again. He's going for it. He's going for the special attack. Question is, what's he going to do? What's he going to do? Come on. Flamethrower. Yeah, yo. Yo. He has a lot of health for it to be moving that slowly. There's a swagger. He's going to raise our attack. And confuse us. Come on. Hurt by poison. All right, what we're going to do is switch out. Because whoever... I'm sorry. Uh, the poison should be able to kill him this turn. Not entirely sure, but poison should kill. If not kill this turn, then definitely next turn. Come on. Hurt by poison. Oh, yeah, like I said, very close. Here's Aqua Jet. What is Aqua Jet for us, family? Yeah, yo. Yeah, yo. Pseudo Wudo. Pseudo Wudo, he's rock type. Don, you're up. You are up, Don. Come on. Come on. All right. All right. Stop dancing. We're fit to give you the business. Here's a force palm. Slam. It's the slam jam. Here we go. Uh, catch you with a waterfall, please. Done with the waterfall. The sneak attack. Come on. Yeah, yo. Hey. Hey, good work. Good work, Team Stabs of Class. I'm proud of Team Stabs of Class today. The Pokemon were hurt before even entering t Rock Tunnel. I better take them to a Pokemon Center right away. You're damn right. You're damn right. I don't know who you thought you were, but you ain't. Let's see. We can go down here. Sneak past this lovely lady. And then I think to get to the po power plant, we need to surf just like we do in, in Gen 1 and then the Gen 3 remakes. Come on. Hey, is this is this gonna be? Yes, a Route Ten encounter. Here we go. Here we go. What we got? 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 Snowrun. Snowrun is dope. Snowrun is dope. Snowrun evolves into two different Pokemon. Uh, quick, first off, we're gonna quick ball this. Just so you gotta know. Uh, any Snowrun can evolve into a Glalie, which is the huge ball of ice with the two cones sticking out his head. And then only female Snorunt, like the one that we just caught, can evolve into Frostlass, which is a dope Pokemon. It's pretty dope. I like it. I I've come to like it. I I've seen different strategies that you can do competitively with Snow uh, Frostlass. So we have Snorunt, the snow hat Pokemon. It's said that if they are seen at midnight, they will cause heavy snow. They eat snow and ice to survive. All right. All right. All right. All right. This, this, this one, this one here, this uh, this Snorunt, this Snorunt is Chomp. Uh, 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 this one is Chompella, Chompella the Snorunt. We have a lot of Pokemon on our, on our in our our roster for Team Snaps and Claps. Just so you guys know, I don't know if you guys have been paying attention. All right, so this is the power plant, and they have an issue here. Before. A wild Pokemon, I'm sorry, a legendary Pokemon used to just gather here. Um, a Zapdos, that jagged chicken. Uh, but now, now, they, they actually use the power plant. A thief broke into the power plant. What is the world coming to? All right. Uh, let's talk to these people so we get some more info. This power plant had been abandoned in the past. We got it back up and running to v provide power to the magnet train. The magnet train consumes a lot of electricity. It can't move if the new generator isn't operating. 
I talk to this man. Maybe he knows something that we can use. The power plant's manager is up ahead. But since someone wrecked the generator, he's been both sad and, at times, furious. Sometimes he would burst out laughing out of desperation. We've had to go through so much. Let's talk to this man. I collect Pokemon. Do you have a dick trio? Want to trade it for my Magneton? No. That's a bad trade. That's a bad trade, Family Lamb. Someone made off with a part that's essential for the generator. Without it, the new generator's useless. Lack of period. So he's still talking. I ain't listening. I ain't listening. He's still talking. Here we go. Let's talk to the manager. I I'm ready to blast something. Who would dare steal a part from the generator? I spent so much time fixing it. If I catch him, he's going to see what I could do with my charge beam. This man sounds dangerous. This man sounds dangerous. Okay, so what we need... What? Let's talk to this man. Or not talk to this man. I just got word from Cerulean. It appears that a shady character has been loading around. Could I ask for your cooperation? The shady character was hanging around the Cerulean gym. All right. We're actually going to do our best as vigilantes to uh, go and find this missing part ourselves. Because it seems as though no one here wants to do anything about it. Y'all just want to sit around and complain. Complain that shit ain't working. So we're going to fly back to Cerulean City. We're going to fly back to Cerulean. And then we'll be able to look for this man, this shady character, and this missing part. I hope this shady character isn't isn't our, our wonderful our, our wonderful rival. Let's see. This Cerulean gem. Hey! Look at this man. He bumped into us. Oops. I'm so sorry. You're not hurt, okay? I'm very busy. No time for talking with you. Not good for me if seen by somebody. Oh, no. You've seen me already. I make big mistake. Hey, you. Forget you see me, okay? You seen, heard, know nothing, okay? Bye. Bye-bye, a go-go. This shady character. Okay, he might have hit something. Here, let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we can find it. Is it not here? I know y'all like hanging stuff in, in statues. Let's see. Is it in the water? This man put the part in the water. That's actually very dangerous. It's dangerous. Let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we can find it. Is it here in the water? Is it here in the water? Because he was facing the water, wasn't he? I could have swore he was facing the water. Let's see if we can find it. Is it there? No? No? Not finding it. Here we go. Let's check here. Let's check here. Let's check here. Nope. We're checking every tile. We are checking every single tile, ladies and gentlemen. It's not in the water. This man didn't throw it in the water. It's not here, at least. Let's see if we can. Can we? All right. Is there any gym leader here? No? There's no trainer either, so I don't have to worry about getting caught. Fine. Because honestly... I don't think we're supposed to be here right now. I don't think we're supposed to be at this uh, this lovely gym just yet. It's kind of it's kind of looking closed. I feel like if the gym leader was here, first off, if the gym leader had a bit of responsibility, they would have locked the door so the shady figure didn't come in here. Dang it! It's not on this part either. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. All right. Not here. Not here. It's not in this. This part of the, the pool either. Okay, so where the hell is it? Where the hell is this piece? Am I not, am I not, am I not doing the right? It's not here? It's not here. Okay, so let's see if it's over here anywhere. Does this man jump in the water and swim? Let's see. No, no. Move, Perry. Perry, you are in the way. He's very eager. I'm glad for you. Perry, you're in the way. So where the hell is this piece? Is the piece not hidden here? I'm kind of going off what I know about Gen 2. I know the piece was hidden in the statue. That's why I went right to the statue at the beginning. Uh, but it, it seems to not be here at all. I need something like an item finder to, to help me find this item. Where, where, where would the piece be? It's not. It's not. No, it's not. Okay. So the piece is in here. The piece is here. What if I go outside? What if I go outside? Neither? No? I saw the shady guy in black go off toward the cape. Oh, so we went off toward the cape. Okay, so let's go follow him there. Let's go follow him there. This woman has a slow bro. 
My Slowbro and I make an awesome combination. Slowbro, show me your psychic. Slowbro, psychic hits hard. All right, let's go towards the cape. Cerulean, uh, Cerulean, Cerulean cape. Uh, am I going the right way? This doesn't look for me. Okay, here we go. This is the cape here. Please tell me. Oh, right here. Okay. This man. Is that his attempt at hiding? Is he attempting to hide from me right now? Right here? Right here. Oh, no! Hiding I was, but you didn't find me in no time. Me only one from another country. Yet. No big business, okay? Think I did. If I if stopped energy, be big panic and unlucky for here people. Wow, he's just his his language gets worse and worse with every sentence. Like I'm in my mind saying, did I read that wrong? It doesn't make sense. No, I didn't read it wrong. It doesn't make sense. Secret, it is my mission, so I tell you I not. But if when you do versus me, a man I be in mind secret to you tell. You understand? Battle begin we do. That's the only part I understood. What would have been dope for this battle is if they would have played parts of it out of order. For this stupid ass grunt. He's got the sea kick. Oh yeah, he's going down. He's going down. Catch his metal cloth. Catch his metal cloth family lamb. All right, we got to tighten up. We got to tighten up. There's a flail. Yes, we need to tighten up. It's not going to do much, but it's a flail nonetheless. Flail flail deals more damage as its user has less health. So we're going to need to start one-shotting here. Aqua Ring is going to start healing. Come on. All right, Victoria, you're up. Come on. Come on. Mm. Good work. Good work, Tear Snaps and Claps. Hey. Mm -mm. Aye. No, no, no. Believe it, I can't. Strong very much you be. Match I am not to you, is what I believe it said. Okay, tell you my secret will I. Machine parts steal by me. Hide it I did in Jeru Gem of Cerulean. Near inflatable too put it I did. Look for Jim at. But you forget me not. Beat you for sure, will T Rocket. Come from Jota, will they? Mine allies. Yes, we're revenge they are. You say what? Team Rocket bye bye a go go? Broken up it is, says you? Oh no. Should I do what now on for me? Okay, I, my country, go home. Make Team Rocket, I will. Goodbye. So long. All right, so the machine part is at the K, uh, the gym. Turns out you have to activate it first. <laughs> you have to activate it first before you can uh, go in and find the piece. So let's go in and find the piece. Uh, inner tube here. Oh Lord, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. All right, we're gonna try this again. We're gonna try this again. Here we go. Not there. He hit it near an inner tube. He hit it near an inner tube. So like, how near? Because <laughs> how near? Let's see. Not there, not there. Yo, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate. I don't remember this being so bad. I remember this being so bad. Get in the water. If you don't get in this water, oh my God. Oh, sweet Lord. Come on. All right, it's not there, not there. Oh, well. That's what happens when you speed through things, ladies and gentlemen. When you speed through, you make things harder than it needs to be. All right. So here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. How near, how near an inner tube is this thing? Because 
Because I'm not seeing it. Okay, if it's not on this other side, I'm going to be pissed. Because that means it's in the statue. Okay, there we go. It's part from machine. All right, good to go. It's GTFO. Now we can head back to the, what's it called? We head back to the, um, what do they call it? What do they call it? We get back to the power plant, give them the part, and then the train will work. So we will have access to another way to jump between Kanto and Johto, which I'll actually use because there was something that I said I needed in this episode, and now I can't remember it. <laughs> so I'm going to have to watch this to, to go get that item, whatever it was. I'm going to do my best. You guys know I'm doing my best to try and remember things. I'm, yeah, I'm doing better with remembering stuff. I'm, I'm exercising memory skills. And sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. Sorry. Alright, so we're back at the power plant. We have the missing machine part. So let's go ahead and talk to the manager. Ah, yes! That thing you have! Is that the part that was stolen from my beloved generator? You found it? Thank you so much. Now all I have to do is attach this part here. Yes, it's running. Arr, arr. <laughs> ah, thanks. Here, go ahead and take this TM as a reward. We got TM57. Normally it's charge beam. Normally it's charge beam. TM57 is my charge beam. It will shoot beams, and it can also sometimes raise special attack. All right, scale of 1 to 10. Gravity. Gravity is actually not too bad. It makes it so that ground type moves um, can attack Pokemon that have flying or that are flying type as well as have levitation. All right, not bad. Okay, so now that's working. We can use the Magnet Train from Saffron City to head back and forth between Kanto and Johto. Uh, I want to do one more thing this episode. One more thing before we wrap it up. Here's here's Route Ten. All right, one more thing before we wrap it up. We went on to Route 10. We caught Snorunt. We caught, uh, what I named the thing? I don't remember what I named the thing. We caught the Snorunt here in the water on Route 10. We should be able to catch something here. Where, where's the jump? Dang it, this is still Route 10 here, isn't it? Yeah, this is the Snorunt. Let's see. I'm going to do one more thing on this route just so that we never really have to come back here. Because it's kind of out of the way kind of out of the way yes route nine what's on route nine please don't be a snow rat this is gonna be a long day deli bird there are deli bird on route nine so this is gonna be our route nine encounter here deli bird should fall into the uh quick ball come on there's two. Oh, it's gonna escape all right all right, Della Bird. Present. Present dealt one damage. Present can do one or two things. It can deal damage or it can heal. It's up to chance. It's 100% up to chance. There's no influencing it. Come on. Come on. Present. That one dealt damage as well. It dealt damage as well. Here's the a, here's a Super Fang. Come on. That one dealt. The super fang it again. Eventually, it's gonna heal us. Eventually, that thing's gonna heal. Nope, not today though. Here's another fang. Hold this fang for us, bruh. Come on. Yeah, it healed. Thank you. All right, and now we can catch it. It will be all right. We need to use. Let's use the. Let's see, love ball. Let's use a love ball. Opposite gender. Never mind. That's not how this game works. Uh, let's ultra ball it up. It's Ultra Ball. I just wanted to be in a cool ball. I just wanted to be in a cool ball. Ultra Ball's okay. All good. All good. We got Deli Bird on the team. All right, Deli Bird. Let's read the Pokedex entry for Deli Bird. It's the delivery Pokemon. It nests at the edge of sharp cliffs. It spends all day carrying food to its waiting chicks. All right. Deli Bird. Della Bird, we're gonna call this one. 
This is a helper. This is a helper of the Delibird, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like box one should be full by now. All right, so that was our encounter for Route 9. Let's do one more. We'll do one more encounter. There's an area here. Please don't. Okay, cool. There's an area here which leads to Lavender Town. You guys remember Rock Tunnel? It's the bridge between, uh, what, Cerulean City and Lavender Town. We're, let's see, we won't need to heal. We're going to go in, catch something, and be right out. Actually, I think we'll be able to fly back here. All right, so what can we find here in Rock Tunnel? What are we going to find? What are we going to find right by the door? What's right by the door? Hey, a Snover. Snover has snow warning, right? Yes, snow warning. All right, pretty cool. Pretty cool. So we whipped up a hailstorm. Let's see if we can catch him one shot. We'll be all right. Quick ball. Come on. Come on. There's one. There's two. There's three. We got it. We got Snover. I've actually never really used Snover. I don't think I've ever caught a Snover, to be honest. Snover or a Bomb of Snow. It's the Frost Tree Pokemon. During cold seasons, it migrates to the mountain's lower reaches. It returns to the snow-covered summit in the spring. Give it a name, of course. Of course we will. Uh, this is... This is... This is the Frost King. Everybody welcome the Frost King to the team. Yeah, box one is full. I called it right on it. He's a box two. He's a box two. All right, guys. That's going to be it for today. What I'm going to do tomorrow, uh, between tomorrow, today and tomorrow, is all heal up, train the team, switch some members in and out, and train up the team so that we are ready to take on... The Vermilion City Gym. We gotta, we gotta start with the gym. So we gotta keep, keep on it. We've accomplished many things in today's episode. Now we gotta keep accomplishing more. So tomorrow we'll take on the Vermilion City Gym. If you guys enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Nuzlocke, would love to see more. Then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And I'll do my best to make sure you guys can see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like the Nuzlocke Run, as well as everything else that All Play has to offer. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you adventurers later with more here on Alt Play. Team Snaps the Class is back in the building, baby. We are here. We're ready to go. How you feeling, Perry? He's holding something. Let's take it from him. Oh, he didn't want to let it go. All right. We'll see you guys later. Bye.